day 199, Park 32, Mesa Verde National Park. I am currently on the Point Lookout Trail, 2.2 miles, roughly 500 feet gain. Most of the trails and views you get here, from what I've heard and understand, it's mostly these cliff dwellings. Oh wow. Oh buddy. You wanna find the edge. There it is, looks like. Here. The real daredevils get down to this rock. It just does not seem like a good idea. You slip, that's it, you're gone. There's uh there's no stopping here. We're not playing with that one, so we'll come back over here. I like this one more. This is a good rock. Stable, sturdy. This bad boy ain't going anywhere. It's got a little coverage. find it funny that the one other guy who got up here before me, the one other person parked in the amphitheater parking lot, as I was not 100 feet into the trail, he was coming out. So there are good views up there. Yeah, they're decent. <laughs> I think these might be the best views you get here, other than the cliff dwellings. Two tours you need tickets for. Cliff Palace, non-interactive. I think it's shorter, it might only be like a half hour. Basically, you get a look from the outside in at these ruins on this tour. And the one that I am doing is Longhouse Tour, which she said is more interactive. I think it's like an hour long and I get to climb two 15-foot ladders. Massive parking lot amphitheater. When you turn into Amphitheater, bottom left hand corner is the trail to Point Overlook. Are you folks coming up with us or are you coming off of that group? Well, welcome to Longhouse, everyone. My name is Jackie. I'll be your ranger for this tour. Um, I do want to remind everyone, of course, that this is a ranger assisted tour. And so if you'd rather move through at your own pace, that's just fine. The second largest of the cliff dwellings here at Mesa Verde, there's over 600 cliff dwellings here in Mesa Verde National Park. Um, and most of them, of course, are much smaller than this. The majority of them are going to be 10 rooms or less. So Longhouse with 150 rooms is the second largest, and it's a lot bigger. Um, Cliff Palace is the largest, of course, that also has 150 rooms, so I'm not really sure who decided that that one was bigger, but there you have it. Longhouse, although it's a very big cliff dwelling, is not a very big village, uh, because the Pueblo people who lived here at Mesa Verde actually lived throughout the Four Corners region. So the question was about where you get your water, and then the follow-up question was common areas. Guesses about where you might get your water from the longhouse? 
Rain is one good answer. Let's smoke on the ceiling. There's a second story here. Just, so where you're standing here is very similar to where we started off. You can see my green dot. It's very similar to this area here. Right? You're standing in a two-story complex of the room. that this was Mesa Verde National Park Longhouse Tour. If you like Mesa Verde, hit the like button. If you like national parks and want to follow me to more, hit the subscribe button. Follow me on Instagram to see more of my landscape photography. This is pretty well cut too. Smaller.